Right, we're in amongst our bit of a mess at the moment. Um, I thought I'd just have a, I was about to have a clean up and I thought I'll just test this little unit here. Um, as you all know, I'm not getting any younger and um, being able to see some of these bits and pieces is getting harder and harder on some of these small PCBs. And um, um, this is a VX7 handheld that we've got to change a filter out of, um, <coughs> excuse me. Um, and um, they, uh, they had a few problems with the 455 filters, but uh, that being said, sometimes seeing these things is a lot easier with a device like this where you know, we can actually come down um, and I can do a broader view than that because um, I don't quite need to have that sort of definition. So don't mind me, I'm just going to move around a little bit here and we're going to refocus. Probably make a liar out of me now. There we go. And refocus onto that board. And of course I can move that board around and have a bit of a look at what's going on there on the uh, larger screen and um, uh, often you know this is a great way to pick up on little dry joints and problems with um, uh, components that you know maybe you're not picking up with your eyesight you've, you've just got an ability just to uh, uh, chuck it under a little device like this here and um, this one's an El Chipo this is not expensive I think it was under a hundred dollars out of uh, Banggood and um, but for what I need uh, look perfect for just being able to get in there sometimes and um, have a bit of a look. Uh, there are some fundamental ways you can change it around so that if your uh, base plate is needing to be you know a lot larger than this here um, you can actually detach and do some things as uh, some quite smart uh, ways to uh, to make it just do um, a little bit more. Now let's have a look. Let's, let's see like if I'm starting to have a look at an FT sorry uh, it was a VX uh, a VX7 like this here and I'm going through and I'm, I'm looking for anomalies etc um, much easier to do it like this. Now I can take that down, <coughs> excuse me, back down again. So we'll have to refocus. There we go. So really can get on those joints and find out just what's happening at surface mount level. And um, you see um, um, TRX Bench doing this quite a bit. Um, sort of what got me thinking. Um, I'm sure uh, our good old mate from TRX Bench has the same problem. We're not getting any, getting any younger and being able to just focus something up. Uh, now he uses a lot more high level, <laughs> higher level equipment than I do, I must, must be very honest. Um, often I'm trying to assimilate some of the equipment but I can't meet the costings. <laughs> but uh, but I've got to say, you know, this is a, a nice little device for, uh, I think it was about Oh, it's either 69, 79 or 89, something like that. Whatever it was, it was under $100 and, um, you know, really very, very handy for uh, those of us that are getting a bit dated with our eyes. All right, um, I could um, probably go through some of the other functions of it, um, but the truth is I haven't had a play yet. I, like if you said to me, what do the arrows do? Let's find out, I suppose. Uh, it looks like a magnification. I think I'm seeing four times... Oh, I see. Yep, yep. So I'm bringing up the magnification, and I should be able to put my finger here. That's just bringing down the magnification. Don't know if I'd use that so much. I think I like just being able to, uh, you know, come in closer, refocus, and really get a real good idea of what I want to look at myself. It just seems faster um, and more appropriate for what I'm going to be doing. Uh, seems like. Uh, what's the M do? Let's have a look here. Oh, there you go, menu. Righto, so it does have a menu, so you can go through your menus and <laughs> I won't even try to tell you what's in all these. Some of the pretty standard, um, uh, just um, auto power off and etc. So, yeah, all good. And what is our D button? That's probably worth having a look at. All right. I might have to read the manual for that one. So it's got um, 1080 FHD. Oh, sorry, I can see up the top there. Sorry. Yeah, there it is. 1.3 megapixels. So it's just changing the, the definition. Um, 1.3 megapixel. And that must be... Is that 1080 there? Oh, I'm not sure. Let's have a little look at that. Um, <laughs> usually the last thing I do is... Um, have a look at paperwork but the good news with this unit is it does come with uh, paperwork if I can just get this screen protector off this thing that's stuck over here 
Um, don't mind this, this is another little thing from, we'll show you probably the next video on this one. This one's kind of neat. I'll just give you a quick preview. Uh, if I remember how to turn it on. Oh, goodness. Where is the on off switch in this thing? There it is. Uh, we'll, we'll go into this a little bit later on. Uh, 100 meg um, uh, little handheld oscilloscope. Anyway, won't worry about that for the moment. Uh, and good. <laughs> so, yes, it does come with uh, instructions, which, uh, you know, normal people read these first. I don't. I'm terrible. I just want to hook it up and see what's going on. Uh, but there is quite a bit of uh, discussion here on 1 to 1200 times magnification. So, you know, not bad. Just seeing if they've got a thing about their... Oh, here we go. Ah, actually, there you go. Um, oh, okay, so it must have a memory so that you can actually do um, a playback of something so you can record and play back. Oh, we'll have to have a look at that. Um, and you can uh, confirm the page up and zoom, uh, the zoom sort of up and down, sorry. And yeah, it's just a distance adjustment which we were playing around with. But yeah, look, all pretty simple. Didn't really need to read too much of the menu, to be honest. Um, certainly, yeah, look, nothing there that's going to be all that exciting but um, certainly for for what it is a, uh, a great little device so if you're um, doing like I do late at night sometimes and you're hanging around Banggood um, and these things come up on special well you know probably for the money I've got to give it a big thumbs up um, it's been working more than five minutes and it's been here how's that eh? Uh, so uh, <laughs> I know there's a lot of criticism of some of the Chinese stuff um, uh, to be honest, I haven't really had cause to have uh, a huge amount of criticism. Most of it works. Um, you know, maybe not quite to spec of some of the real big name stuff, but geez, most of it does work. Anyway, that's it. This will hopefully help my eyesight a bit. Uh, it's this one's called the Must Tool. Um, uh, official name is uh, Portable LCD Microscope. Um, so there you go. That's called a G1200. So. If you uh, are on Banggood floating around, they weren't expensive, very cheap. You can see now that it works. It certainly works for a small, delicate work like this. Um, really quite a godsend. I mean, I've got to change uh, that filter there. I'll be putting it under there to make sure that I've got no stray little solder joints or anything. Um, uh, the other thing that um, might be interested in, which we'll review at some stage, now look at this. Um, these are the new um, tweezers. So for surface mount, so they're basically soldering iron tweezers, and you can just get in there, get your bit, pull it out, do the opposite, put it back in, etc., and put it back into this little mess here. And this is definitely a mess in here at the moment. So please, um, I'm embarrassed that there's so many tools and rubbish lying around. I have not been out here for a couple of weeks, uh, really doing anything. So the next couple of days, we've got to get cleaned up in here. All right, there you go. Another product brought to you by the uh, Banggood, the Chinese, and the whole story um, gets a big thumbs up from from uh, from my old eyes. All the best. 70 trees from VK3, Charlie Mike. Please subscribe. Uh, we're nearly on 2,000, I think. So um, hit that subscribe button. We won't even charge you for it. There's no fee. Uh, so uh, please hit that subscribe button. We're really interested to see how far we can go with this. Cheers. All the best.